I am Major General Bertrand Toujouz. I am Head of French SOCOM, le commandement des opérations spéciales, ou COS, in France. Uh, this uh, command has uh, three specific missions. First, it has been since its uh, creation in 1992, uh, Crisis Response Force for French Armed Forces. Second point, it has uh, taken for past 10 years a leading role in the fight against terrorism, uh, in which it integrates a number of contributions from other uh, armed forces. And third, it remains in support of all other uh, domains of action of uh, armed forces, specifically today regarding great power competition. I am here in the United States because the uh, US Special Operation Command is our main ally and partner in the world. So I needed to come here to make a number of points uh, with our allies, uh, specifically in three different uh, spaces. First, it was in Fort Bragg, where I met the Special Operation Command for the Army, and I met uh, too with uh, JSOC, who is the main HQ dealing with counterterrorism mission. Second, I went to Tampa, where is located the US SOCOM. This is the main command for Special Operation Command in uh, the US, and with SOCCENT, uh, which is a dedicated staff for Middle East issue. And then I ended in Washington, where I met in J5 in Pentagon, people dealing with uh, policy and plans. And then ASD SOLIC, uh, with a counterpart dealing with all terrorism and countering strategy issues. I see three main topics. First one is how uh, do we maintain and enhance our cooperation regarding fight against terrorism. It's mainly today in Sahel and in Middle East, but it could be in other places uh, in the future. So we have to maintain our ability to respond uh, together to this kind of issue. Second point is to work upon what could be the, our cooperation in the field of grey area hybrid warfare. We are contested by numerous actors today in the world and it remains important. And third, we have a specific everyday life cooperation regarding uh, exercises, exchanges. We have quite an important network of uh, liaison officers and we could develop our embedded officers and uh, NCOs in our different units.